guys uh, on this video we're looking at gold of which this is a setup that we recently took in the vip group and my free telegram channel you can just use the link in the description below so that you can join the vip group or the free telegram channel so looking at the overall structure on gold we have been pushing to the upside up until we came from this point we created a lower low after creating this lower low here we came to the upside and then tried to create like a higher high of which we failed we created a lower high also and then we came here to create like equal lows around this point here as you can see these are equal lows and then after that we had like our first break of structure around this point and then we broke a few areas as you can see here we also had like some type of a break of structure and then we pushed to the upside we created a higher high a higher low and then after we created another higher high and then we created a higher low around this point here which is here and then after that we created a higher high so on that higher high what we were expecting is for us to get like a higher low and then after that we create a higher high so this was our target as you can see from my analysis and then the target was at this supply area if you look left and then you try and zoom in from this point this was our target and then as you can see this is an imbalanced price action or this is an inefficient price action as you can see you can just use like an imb and then looking back to the overall trade on the hour time frame I'll show you on the hour time frame. So on the hour time frame, we knew that we have like some type of a demand area around this point of which is inefficient price action. We had no retest around this point. And then after creating that high high, we created a lower low around this point. And then after seeing that we created that lower low, I decided that I should draw like a break of structure around this point and then look at the last candlestick that broke structure. The last candle that gave us this momentum to break like this low here and then this was our supply area of which you can just refine it on the lower time frame so looking at the 30 minute that is where you'll see that supply area very nice of which is this one but i refined it to this candle here so that is where we took our entry and then my stop loss should have been like very very tight of which it should have given me like a 37 percent rr but i decided to leave it at that and then just leave it around this point so looking at the overall trade, we were from a 7% profit. And then I decided to leave it just because, as you can see, we also broke structure around this point here. And then we know our initial target is to fill those imbalances. So let me just remove that, is to fill this inefficient price action around this point. And then after filling this inefficient price action, then that is when we can just push back to the upside. So looking at the 15-minute time frame, that is where we broke structure, as you can see. And then switching to the five minute also, you'll see that the last candle that broke structure was this one. But as you can see, it was violated. And then I think we had like some type of inefficient price action around this point, just like that. So this is the area whereby uh, gold is at. But at the moment, we are still holding the trade. And then the overall target that we are looking forward to seeing is about 15%. So I hope you enjoyed this video and then comment the takeaway from this video or something that you learned in this video. And then I'll see you on another one.